What's up, guys? Alex and Greg. Great, super seducer three. Here with Super Seducer Two, gonna be teaching Greg some ways to speak to women. Uh, we did play this before, and we kind of screwed it up. Interracial dating. Jesus. Oh, we have to finish that one. Yeah, let's finish just finish it up. All right. Oh, obviously, we didn't make this game. It's available on Steam for ten dollars. Some of the stuff that we tried out uh, makes a pretty decent amount of sense. Isn't yeah, really like, like obviously not, one. obviously not being sexually provocative towards the women. Yeah, boss oh. and secretary. I, uh, I did everything I could to fend off. Not, I wanted to start a relationship. Yes, he wanted to say some very funny <laughs> stuff. Let's see what he would say. Uh, let's see. All right, here we go. Here we go. Mike, I really liked our first lesson. So, what are we gonna do today? We're in the restaurant. Maybe do some food stuff. Some food, yeah. Yeah. Some, some, some food stuff. Okay. Wait. Let me remember. Okay. Some last let time. me remember <laughs> last time. <laughs> yeah, I still can't figure out this guy's accent. Very good. Yes. Yeah. Right, we're, we're gonna, gonna skip through this. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna skip this. As long as the conversation gets a little long. Yeah, I didn't have to drink. Get strong. He's learning some Chinese. No man, I haven't eaten. I've been drinking with you. I'm trying to teach you Chinese. Whilst you're drinking all the vodka. Yes, that means is it good enough? Is it good? This is right there. How pale out. Yes. Very nice. Alright, there's our target. Okay, we're gonna skip that. We're gonna skip that. And All right. da, 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 most Asian guys think they have the same chance. Which is very true, actually. Uh, being, being Asian, um, we don't approach like girls very often. <laughs> well, not me anyway. Asian guys don't approach Western women. That means it's your chance, buddy. She ain't used to it, alright? I just guys are like. He's such a right? She ain't used to it. Yeah, yeah, I'm right. Always right. Even when I'm wrong, I'm right. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> That's the right option. And, you know, for this level, I got some uh, great advice from JT Chan from uh, ABCs of Attraction. He's the top Asian dating coach. And oh. he said that his mm. clients normally have this problem where they don't really approach Western women at all. Really? Mm -hmm. I didn't know this. Me, man. I think I'm gonna go talk to her. That was a compelling yeah. argument. <laughs> <laughs> oh, money. I'm gonna pick up all this, but I never got it. His face. I can't get over his face. I, look like oh. I don't care that I'm drunk. I look like a fat <laughs> Any of you guys in Europe watching this right now, do you guys have to look like that? Or is that like a, this guy's just born to be this moron? Okay, last time we did this, it said to be himself. Good advice, not good for the game. So, um, hmm. tell him Western girls suck and only an Asian guy, only want an Asian guy for his money. That's a pretty good argument. Hmm. No, I'm just kidding. That's kind of racist. A little bit. I mean, sexist. Tell Expressive him of West, because Western girls think Asian guys are too poker-faced. Should I just do that one? We are very, some of us are very poker face, I believe. Oh, I, thought, I thought A on the keyboard would work. Nope. Oh, I gotta click it. Michael, go. yeah, listen. Western girls, like that one, yeah? They think that Asian guys are poker face. Right? So we need to be more expressive, like me, like mm, smiling, yeah? Alright. You should have just expressive. gotten drunk if you can't act drunk. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Alright. Oh, Alright. Here we go. This is one of the stereotypes, again, what? that Western women oh. have. You know, there are some positive and some negative stereotypes. So being more expressive is a nice way to overcome that particular stereotype. <laughs> that, no that, that, no his his lady that. counterpart just seems so... Like, yeah, I'm here. Yeah. Thanks for the advice, man. <laughs> oh, God. Mm, what was the last one that we did? Okay, I'm leaning towards the opera, but uh, under your pants, cover your dick with a cushion, then unveil it in front of her. No, I don't think that's a good um, idea. Okay, okay. <laughs> that would be a funny one to what see. About but it? be indirect and ask her opinion on whether you should get a piercing. That's kind of cool. Hey, I don't know you, but uh, where should I get a piercing? Where would it look nice? That's that, that's fucking creepy. 
I think the compliment would probably Direct be. compliment? Yeah. Unless you want to see what happens with the opera. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. <clears throat> oh, God. Wow. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Last time we did this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is it working? Wait. Is she going to film you? Wait. Oh, we're going to be an internet sensation. We don't need this. Oh, lady. my God. And he's doing it in Italian. Like, Tell me this is gonna work. This is gonna work. Last time we did this, we did the uh, the compliment. Yeah. And it took us forever to get to where we needed to go. Oh my God. Is this gonna work? That was amazing. That was very good. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, that's great. good. If he is a great singer, really, that's it's better if he's a bad singer. It's really bad. <laughs> so it's almost right. If you're, yeah. If you're a great singer, then yeah, use that to your advantage. I'd say. Really. I'm quite a good singer. I, the floor's yours. <laughs> <laughs> you're like what? <laughs> so my name's Michael. What's your name? Uh, I'm Anna. Anna. Nice to meet you. Yeah. What are you doing sitting here by yourself? Um, I'm actually waiting for a friend. Okay. Uh, yeah. Do you mind if I keep you company until okay, she gets yeah, here? Work that. Um, I think she's gonna be here in five minutes. But I'll leave the moment she comes. Yeah. Just. Okay. Sure. Yeah. That guy. I can't. That guy in the background. He's so distracted. He is I so. Know what the hell I know. Doing? You said this guy's your student. What is it that you teach him? <laughs> she's rubbing one out back there. <laughs> um. Wanna be honest, teach them, we're teaching them Chinese. We tried that last time. Yeah, okay. So, so let's try something a little different. Dating skills is a joke. Or ancient sex techniques. Should I we think that's a bit forward, but we can see what happens if we well, click it. I'm an expert in many things, and my friend here, he's going through a bit of a rough patch, so I'm teaching him some ancient sex techniques. <laughs> that, oh, that was great, that expression. <laughs> ancient Chinese. Oh my god, I don't. Okay. By the way, we are playing this for fun. Well, they were. But giving some advice while we're doing it. I just don't believe you. Yeah? I'm sorry. I well, don't I believe could, I could prove it to you. No. Uh, oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Go away. That's a no no. No. I don't even sorry, have to touch that's... you. That's a no no. For everyone out there, that is a no no. Oh. Oh, no. We upset her. You're gonna bang her brain? What the fuck is wrong? This guy. He's done. Do you oh. know any ancient uh, Chinese sex techniques? Surprisingly not. Ancient Egyptian? No, not that. Look, at the, look what's going on with the screen! Yeah, Greek. Look at the guys! Here, aren't we? Babylonian. North? Oh my god. What the hell's going on? He's been like manhandled. <laughs> Alright, let's just go with the correct answer. Oh god. Yeah, I mean, um, I mean, I grew up in the UK. So my Chinese isn't perfect, but because I'm a friend of a friend, you know, he got me to teach him, so. Mm -hmm. That's fantastic. That's really cool. So how do you know Chinese if you grew up in the UK? Oh, my parents are from China. Oh, you know, nice. I was born in the UK and, you know, I grew up speaking it. And actually, when I was a kid, my Chinese was better than my English. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. OK, but so there. that's your first language. Yeah. 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 Oh, nice. And so both your parents are Chinese? Yes, yes. Okay. And have you been to China? Yes. Went quite a lot when I was young. So, mm -hmm. have you? The best part no. of this is this guy sleeping oh. in the back no, and drunk never. and nobody going yeah. like, hey, you know what, I should probably kick this uh, guy I'd out. I'd like to. <laughs> yeah, you should if you haven't. Mm. That's the right answer, you know, in this case, you could have joked. No, I did not expect that opera part. That was very, I'm still stuck on it. That is so surprising. That's how I met Jess. I sang her an opera. The Bugs Bunny one. Can you speak some Chinese? Yeah. Could you like to sing it for the audience? No, I'm good. You sure? No, I'm good. I'm good, buddy. I organize events, so mainly music events, where I scout out bands and solo artists and then put it all together. Um, that's, yeah, that's what I do. I really enjoy it, and I want to like do weddings hoop. in the end. So, I mean, it sounds like you have quite a creative side, you know, if you're 
involved with music, you know, even if it's just as an organiser, I mean, mm. that must interest you. Yeah, exactly. I love, I, I have a massive creative side, so I kind oh, of like, do, the I like doing everything. And it's really nice putting people together and kind of mm -hmm. starting, a, you know, a party and things. I bet. Um, yeah. Do you, do you like events? Nah, never been to one ever. Um, Hate them. Yeah, I mean, yeah. music events, yeah. yeah. I mean, Chinese sounds really cool. Um, could you teach me something? In oh, Lordy. What will we teach her? Oh, I think we taught her about the I like you thing. Yes. Yeah. That was the last time we tried the I uh, like you thing. Say um, that you want to like it. want something <laughs> Obviously, I think C is a no-no. Um, teach her to say, I am horny. Please help me. But <laughs> make her think she's saying it like that she's saying she likes cats. Yeah, I don't know. I used to do that in high school and like middle school. People would be like, can you do the Spanish homework for me? And I'd be like, yeah, 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 I got you. And then I'd be like, give them all the wrong Teacher, I think the teacher to introduce yourself. Don't hit the fucking mic, Greg. Be professional for once. Will you introduce yourself? No. Teacher, introduce yourself would be... guess what this one Nice, I guess, but not forward. Right, you would say? Not forward enough? Oh, I mean, this game is just so... It's like a friggin' catwalk. Michael. It's a friend zone or completely being a Anna. pig. That's right. <laughs> like like that. What's your Michael? So it means um, okay. who's your Michael? Who's your Michael? Who's your Watch out, Anna. Watch ah, out. Okay. Good. Yeah. So I was like, watch out, Anna. Like, like watch <laughs> out. <laughs> no problem. This is a. What's your Richard? Did you tell him a and what does wow. that mean? Oh, wow. This is what he knows Chinese like, too, huh? Yeah. So it's a little bit boring in this yeah. case. Oh, fuck no. you. Yeah. I, I agree. I mean, it's, it's happened to me before. Where they, and, you say, and you go, oh, oh, that's what's your name. So they're saying to be... It's a little bit boring. It's so a trickery. Forward, but not it's too forward. End, it? Yeah, you, this is... I mean, if you speak some languages, have some idea of some cool uh, phrases that you can teach because it's actually a nice little moment that you can possibly have versus just teaching that them black how to guy say hello like and what's your name. Yeah. Yeah. He's, just cool. he's just like, he's really don't impressed by his chef. I've been teaching you some Chinese. Why don't you teach me something? Do you speak any other languages? No, I don't. No, no boring. It's really bad. Ha hashtag basic bitch. When I was in school, I did a little bit of French, but oh, it's no. really bad. I'm not going to you. Like, oui, oui, monsieur. Like that. That's <laughs> all right. But know. you must, so do you speak other languages? Uh, I speak a bit of Russian. Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. Wow, good um, spy. Do you want to say anything in Russian? Uh, <laughs> oh, nice. Um, do you speak any other languages? I speak Russian a little bit. bit of I know a phrase. Yeah. Ooh, Idi means come here in uh, Russian. Russian. <laughs> uh, and so Russian, Italian, Chinese, and English. Yes. All he Look said at that guy. was fuck off in Italian. How is this guy? That's amazing. He's passing off. Oh, fuck this guy. That is lying. That's not a good way to start a relationship. All right, we did this last time. We did Fortnite. No, we are not talking about was Fortnite. This hilarious. Time. Donald Trump, I do not believe will work. No I mean, one wants to talk about politics. We're in the UK, right? Aren't they yes, just going to make no, fun of them? That's kind of weird why they threw it in there. Uh, tra I would say travel. Travel? Okay, here we go. So do you travel, Mark? Um, not really. I, I want to travel more. Mm -hmm. um, How much would bet he says he's traveled a lot? The place that I've been is Israel. Oh, is Israel? Yeah. Oh, wow. Israel. Oh. Amazing. If you guys want to see the Donald um, Trump one, you, you let me know in the comments well, yes, and I'll make a separate video of it. Into Italy. Russia. And if you guys want, we could also make a video of just making all the bad choices just for you. Like the raccoon one, remember? Oh, Shh, don't, you chill don't. Let's not talk about the raccoon. <laughs> that was Washington, Washington, great. New York. I stand by the decision. <laughs> so kind of that was a fantastic decision. Yeah, yeah, a lot of it. But yeah. Yeah, I've been to uh, as well. Okay. If there's an option yeah, to and not real. to give a raccoon, I'm going to give support. the raccoon 100% of the time. <laughs> just throw yeah, it. but it's very busy. Um... I don't know. What's what's the fav your favorite place that you've been? My favorite place, probably Nova Scotia. Wow. The McDonald's there, they do lobster burgers <coughs> because it's you know it's they like do. A no, they do. Oh yeah, God. yeah. You know, lobsters. Everywhere. If you leave the country and go to McDonald's in another country, it's like. 10 oh yeah, times better. I think nice. they have uh, wow. in India they have uh, all vegan. Yeah. Maybe, right? Yes, I remember those lobster burgers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like food. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I, like oh. I like food. Uh, if you've traveled a lot, travel is a good subject. And if you haven't traveled a lot,
travel is a good subject <laughs> because uh, most people like talking about travel. I think, what was it you said to yesterday about travel? No what one did? ever regrets. Oh yeah, no one ever regrets travel. You may regret a lot of things in life, you might regret the big burger you just ate or the shoes, but never regret travel. And also I think if you, even if you haven't traveled, travel. saying where you would like to, to go Florida. is still on the every subject. Day of my life. Yeah, it's a cool no? subject. No? You don't like Florida? I've been to It's pretty nice. Goldings. It's pretty nice. Is it a girl? Or? A little boring for uh, me. Yeah, but I well, we went to Disney, but there was a tropical rainstorm. So oh, okay. So have the nation guide before. It was a very Jurassic yes, Park Yes, their moment. weather is a bit, uh... Mm. A bit... Well... We're sitting there by the birds, and all of a sudden they all start flying away, and I'm like, ah, oh, it's not a good sign. I've seen Jurassic Park. <laughs> <laughs> I was just looking at her. Uh, tell her she needs to try because Asian is amazing. Um, you... Every argument is won if you end it on a rhyme, as I've heard on different plat pl uh, platforms... <laughs> Uh, oh my god! Or we god. could just say she's racist. I mean, that seems like something that. Uh, no, I don't think we want to guilt her into. We tried this. We one. tried that one. Yeah. The woman or let's, lady. Let's like. try the Asian is amazing. Just to okay, see her right, reaction. Right, Asian is amazing. It ends in a run. Oh, you've never dated an Asian guy. Oh, well, you're missing out. You know that famous saying: once you go Asian, you know it's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen. Oh, I knew you were gonna get that reaction from her. Did you just make no. that up? No. Yeah, fucking did. You so face. you're telling me that face. was the worst choice of all of them? Wow. I don't know if that's the worst one out of all of them. So here it's really weird because <laughs> Anna hadn't heard of the um, common phrase where um, you say once you go Asian, you'll know it's amazing. Oh. You know? Yeah, I've ne it's not been You heard that one? No, I haven't. Huh. Ah. Alright, but is it, what do you think? I mean, a little, no. Because you hadn't dated the Asian <laughs> guy before. <laughs> 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 you know, I'm fine. It's it's amazing, like, amazing, yeah, I get that too. amazing. <laughs> yeah, expl <laughs> explain how it works. Explain Just how it works. Scraping the barrel a little bit there. No, alright. So it wasn't the worst choice. It wasn't the greatest so either. Yeah, but this girl sucks now because it's been, it ended in the rut. She's so bland though. Cocaine? Um, I make really good chicken okay. pie. Um, oh. If she made shepherd's really pie. Like shepherd's that's, pie. That's the UK good. thing. Oh, really? Yes. Yeah. Shepherd's pie is a shit. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, it is. Okay. Demonstrating some value by to talking about The Secret, which is a book, which is one of those like self-help book things. Like if you okay. like wishing something and yeah, it's just like nonsense. Demonstrate some value by talking about we, Buddhism. We talked about it. We Tell her that it's a soft science and that physics is the only worthwhile subject. Okay, that one I don't think is no, gonna work. Gonna she's, go she's a book person. She's, she's we'll a music with, person. She said she was. She said she's in a books, right? She was a music person. She did not. Uh, I'll just talk about Buddhism. Well, that's then. quite a coincidence because I'm really into Buddhism. Yes, we did no, this last time. Really? I started. Yeah, yeah. I started um, meditation. It worked for her it's about a year ago. You know, I find it really helpful because I sit in a room quietly and say nothing. And I'm Life is very busy, busy, and you get all that's these all I hear when you hear people talk about meditation. I like to do meditation as a way to just clear oh my, my head, God. you know, and to get yeah. back, back in touch with myself, and you know, what I want, where I'm going, that kind of thing. So, does that? Yeah, yeah, I do meditation yeah. as well. I love meditation. Yeah, oh, really? yeah, it's really good just to oh, clear my mind and Come on, interest. Mm, mm, mm. spend a little bit of time without any thoughts. Yeah. Totally straightens me out, you know, and yeah. it's you know, just focusing on your breathing. It's like good for you she's healthy oh. yeah yeah that's nice mm -hmm. <sighs> meditation beautiful system so i think yeah if, if you've got uh, buddhism you can talk about that if you're an indian guy talking about yoga and stuff you know if you talk about the things that are you know the highlights or the strong points of your culture or country then um, it's an interesting conversation point. I'd have to talk about political Especially corruption for, for my country. Who are more oh likely God. to be in yeah, so, 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 yoga so, and spirituality. Yeah. That's really yeah, Everyone has their own opinion and uh, we're not going to quite get it. I'm Hispanic, what am I supposed to talk about burritos all the time? Seeing how much she might this know, so how dumb. well traveled or how <clears> interested she is. They're so full of crap. Talk about med you go to LA, you talk to anybody about meditation. Everyone yeah, they'll give you a look. What are you talking about? She can do party tricks with a napkin. So I can make like bunny ears, um, oh. and what else can I make? I oh, okay. Hi, hi, Mary. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. How are you? Yeah, good. Um, this is Michael. Yeah. This is Mary, my friend. 
Oh my god. <laughs> He's killer. MVP right there. I wish the whole game was just him drunk somewhere else. Right, okay. We're not going we to. We did the throw up on the table the last time. Sorry, guys. Uh, I guess... Uh, go back, I would say... Go back to sleep. <laughs> he already creeped them out. Yeah. Because this is the guy. Yeah, I would say go to sleep. Um, so, <laughs> thank you for just keeping me company. But, um, me and there we go. Gonna okay. catch up. Yeah. Oh. Well, it was nice talking to you. Um, yeah, nice talking to you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Enjoy your catch up. Yeah, how are you doing? Yeah, okay. Alright, let's see, let's see what we did. I know, it's lovely to see you. Yeah, oh. no, I'm good, I'm good. Lots of stuff has been going on. Yeah. You're looking good. Oh, thank you. Nah, he's, I guess, oh, day, I love no. Wow, I really... <laughs> got a man up. Yeah. Be a good wingman sometimes. Could have helped your friend out there. <laughs> Alright, so I guess... Oh, uh, fine. Okay, so go let's go help him. Go ahead, help him. Go ahead. I was just showing my... Let's see what happens. <laughs> I don't understand. 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 I don't <laughs> well done. Really? The right option. Obviously, he needs some help because you know her friends. Come so I'm guessing and if you likely they want to catch up and talk, and this is a point where you can easily get sent away. So you need your wingman. Yeah, you don't want to get sidelined in this situation. Because he gave him something to talk about. Yeah. Talk so about that's the friend. An interesting trick with the napkin. Yeah, yeah, it's a good one. Um, She's yeah. good in that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna get a trick. It's part of trick. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, where did you get the mic from? Where? Where? He's so cute. What? 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 <laughs> this game. <laughs> oh, okay. There you go. That's, that's okay. pretty clever. Oh. That's pretty clever. Oh, so you guys, so. He's getting the friend separated now. Okay. That's kind of creepy, though. I know, so right? Done. Just like, hey. <clears throat> My friend likes to dance and sing when he's drunk. Does he? Does he? I bet he's embarrassed you a lot. <laughs> yes. He's embarrassed he everybody in this game right now. Mm, really? Shit. Maybe you want to have had a bit to drink. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure you can. Yeah, I, I can dance. Yeah. Yeah, I really enjoy it. So, I guess. You know, I'm really glad I came over to talk to you. Oh, here we go. You know, here we go. <laughs> Really Are we nice. going to get to that option this time? Yeah, I'm really glad you came over and had the confidence to chat. Just really put a hand out. Maybe, um, maybe we could be friends, actually. That would be nice. That's not the point, though. Friends? You start with friends, right? Assume, right? Oh, oh, here we go. Oh. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, great. Sounds good. I'm not interested in being friends with you. I have too many friends already. Ugh. After she normally does that, stand up and try to make out with her, that seems like... Beg her not to... F what the... None of these no. sound... Good at all, or just I, I guess it a. sounds good. Start as a friend, and then to become something more, maybe, right? I guess everything sounds bad, <laughs> except for yeah, this. One. That sounds like a good idea. Oh yeah, I think it'd be nice to be friends. I mean, don't I tell me he's. Don't tell me he's gonna tell you to do something more aggressive. Oh okay. Well oh. done. Successfully been put in the friend zone. Oh, maybe it's okay. See, yeah, it's now, okay. Maybe you can like work okay. harder to get out of it. Wiggle but out of it. So what yeah, answer? You're most definitely maybe let us redo it and see if we can get no, out of it. So what is it here that we go. you do anyway? Well, oh. when I'm not oh. teaching Chinese, I work as a scientist. <laughs> uh, what what kind of science? Uh, chaos theory, like in the context of biology. So it's a bit of a it's a combination of maths and biology. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that doesn't sound that interesting. Do you I was think you didn't go with that physics answer. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Say she is boring as fuck. Show her how interesting it is and touch her. Or yeah, I her. would say the first I answer only because... Show this one, try to be yeah. creepy. It sounds boring. No, 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 no. Let me prove to you um, how it's interesting. Give me a hand. See? 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 Sneaky of us, see? Your knuckle. Right. Which way do you think it will roll? You know, if I put it right on the this top. This is Jurassic Park stuff. Um, 
Remember, you put it on the head, or so the first time we do it, maybe it'll go down here. The second time, maybe it'll go that way. Maybe it'll go back. It's hard to say, isn't it? Because there's there's too much chaos here. Why? Because the way the droplet falls depends on the orientation of the hairs on your hand, and also the little, the little imperfections in your skin. And uh, <laughs> overall, you know, there's a lot of information. It's very complicated. So you know, it's um, okay. it's chaos. Okay. And this is biology. Ah, nice. So that's basically what you learn. Okay. Mm. And it's everyone's hands, not just mine. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> not, not everyone's got perfect hands. <laughs> okay, see, see. Compliment her neck next. Oh, you learn something oh, you okay. got a great looking neck. <laughs> Indeed, you do. <laughs> <laughs> can oh. I have my hand back? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. It's your hand. You have it back. So that's the right option. It's modeled on the Jeff Goldblum. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Um, and it's basically I've watched proven that point again, movies. where it doesn't matter what you talk about, no. as long as you do it with passion, that passion Damn is an emotion, Adobe. it's contagious, and it's attractive. I totally agree. I honestly think you could be talking about anything, <laughs> nice. rubbish, bin liners, for all I care. As long as you're passionate about it, it's super contagious and very attractive. Passionate about Bin Laden. Oh, God. What? Bin Liners. Ah, Bin Liners. No, oh my cool. God. Or Bin wow. Liners. Wow. Jeez. No. Come on, guys. So other than salad, what kind of food are you into? Um, I'm into like, lots of different food. Um, I love chicken Kievs. Oh, great. Yeah, yes, chicken me too. Kievs. Chicken really Kievs. Really good. Um, I love brownies. Anything We're in the base brownies. of the US. Put a picture yeah. of no idea what that is. <laughs> Put a picture of chicken really Kievs. Like brownies. Yes, I love brownies. Mm. Mm. No idea. Can you bake? Kievs. No. Okay. I'd love to know how to bake, or mm. maybe to meet someone who knows how to bake. Yeah. And so, what kind of food do you like? Me, I'm actually really into sushi at the moment. You know. Oh, Can't nice. get enough raw fish. Imagine they're at I an Asian sushi, place. Sushi, yeah. Are they? Yeah. 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 I love fish as well. See? Yeah. Yes. That's fish. a fucking salad, yeah, right? Good. Yeah, you can get, 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 you you ever had orca come to the steaks? No. How big so orca shot, steaks. You know, yeah, massive. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. So you'll have Terrible. to steak a bit on yes. your... Yes. <laughs> oh, my That's God. You should try sometime. Yeah. Okay. Look, I'm very busy, so I don't want to waste my time. If you're not going to fuck me, what are my chances? Wow. Oh, that sentence doesn't even make sense. No. Turn her on by visually showing her what you'll do to her... I'm going to say vagina. Uh, my friends are going to have a baby boy and are thinking about names. Can you help? What's your boyfriend's name? That's a little too on the As a single girl, I was wondering whether you are into dating so, apps. I, I'm Wait, assuming... hold on. Oh, hold What? Oh, okay. I'm assuming if you say D, she's going to say she doesn't have a... I think C. She doesn't, she doesn't have a boyfriend. She's single. I think C. And if you get C, I think she's going to say... Yeah. Because you're going to find out <laughs> yeah. if she's single or not. Yeah. And then uh, let's, I think it's C. I think it's C. So as a um, single girl, do you prefer to meet people online or do you prefer to meet them in real life? Uh, wait, how did you know that I was single? Yeah, yeah. Well, there were two things that you did earlier that kind of gave it away. Your elbows. What were they? I think I'll keep that to myself for now. I'm going to tell you later. Oh. Nice one. Uh, that's the right option. Aha! Ah! You can use that anywhere. That's the line <laughs> from uh, our friend Pete. And yeah, it works. But what if the really, girl isn't really well, single? With that then you find out if she's not single. Oh. End, it's a way to find out you. that or if she like, yeah, it's a weird thing. Double on double meaning. So meetings. I've had a really great time meeting you and getting to know you. But I'm a bit worried about your friend because my friend Richard, you know, he's a he's a bit crazy. So I think I'm going to go save her, let you guys, you know, have a catch up and then um, I'll be off. But, you know, I think we should see each other again. Uh, uh. Ah. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Suggest meeting for a meal, just the two of them. Suggest that you come to her house and show. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> There's only one choice for that one. <laughs> the feng shui over. That is not All the right, choice. The feng shui. So you said you were already into chicken Kiev, so why don't we have that for dinner one night? Oh. Uh, uh, what? Ah, uh, so it stops her inviting her friends? Yeah, and I think it shows social intelligence because it's like, look, you're here with your friend tonight, so it's not the ideal situation. So 
we can meet just one on one another time and you know it'll be better great no there's no chance oh! of that um, wow. it's a new company though what, what? Uh, it's just not something that I want but we've been Sorry. getting on so well mm. like, wow been for ages oh, why is it going to come off Sorry, I'm going to finish this shadow <laughs> Wow. Shame. What? I wonder what Wow. I guess what the hell did you do? To, I guess you were supposed to talk about the feng shui of her bedroom. What happened? Wait, what? No. Is she going to regret it now? She's not banging. She's not banging. That's kind of awkward. Her friend's there, too. Wait, is it going to be turned around? That seems like the right answer. What? What? Oh, what? Oh, I, didn't, I guess That's I didn't. Right you didn't make, you didn't make all the right choices. I got some uh, great advice from JT Tran from uh, ABCs of Attraction. He's the top Asian dating coach. And he said that his clients normally have this problem where they don't really approach Western women at all. Really? Mm hmm. I didn't know this. Let's get. All right, guys. Got Cuphead today. Um, <laughs> heard it's difficult, but obviously not for a legend like me. Cuphead. Jump, jump, jump. Um, yeah, who was actually playing Cuphead? Uh, okay, it's quite big. Jump, hold for a high jump. Hold for a high jump. High jump. One, two. All right, bear with it, guys. Uh, miss, miss all men. Thanks for the donation. All right, let's oh, get on this. Oh, he's on uh, Twitch. No, that doesn't work. All right. Uh, okay, try that. No, maybe it'll fall down. So just keep jumping. Just keep jumping. Double jump. Okay, from here it's definitely gonna work. Aye, aye. Fucking shit, eh? Oh, lol. What's funny? It's not funny. This is not easy, guys. It's a hard game. Have you heard? I'll get it. Don't worry. Don't worry, I'll get it. I didn't die at least. Alright. Ready? One, two. Ah. Oh my god. Piece of shit game, yeah? John Tag. You are shit at games. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that's like the proper internet. Alright, John Tag. I'll tell you what. <coughs> I'm shit at games. Maybe I'm shit at games because I spend all my time fucking your mum. <laughs> that's why I'm shit at <laughs> That's, that's uh, most of the internet <laughs> yeah, anyway, like right? That. Yeah. <laughs> he got swatted. What? <laughs> what the fuck is this game, man? Wait, what? I read. I made the option. Yeah. Oh my! This is so bad. Oh my god. He told this guy fuck off and that he was banging his mom, so he got swatted, and it was either that or go to the strip club. Oh my god. Oh. Jeez. Wait. Is he going to play himself? Oh my god. Yes, I got shot. So, yeah. Super Seducer 3, I'm going to be a ghost. <laughs> 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 Okay, we have to go to the. <gasps> oh, that's what it was. Oh, we what? have to go to the strip club now. You know what, John? Fuck you. Fuck Twitch. Fuck Cuphead. Hey. I think my controller was broken anyway. Yeah. Hey. Cuphead's a good game. It is a good it game. It is really a difficult yep. though. Oh, it's punishing. That's the right option. Uh, well done. You avoided a horrible death. That's <laughs> funny, huh? Eh? What's the best night? Um, obviously a Tuesday. That's uh, right. Um, Tuesday really? is going to be less oh, people. Okay. Often she's forced to work on these kind of off nights in order to work at the weekend and make loads of money. And so it's a good opportunity to sit down, have a like genuine conversation what? because the place isn't busy. What to wear? Soft trousers? 
obviously. Soft trousers. I haven't heard of this one. What is the soft trouser? A friend of mine, Dave, in New York. You get like an erection. It's going to show. You're that supposed to wear like. That's a soft trouser. Yeah. You wear jeans because they're kind of rough to the touch. So oh. Okay. I've never been to one of these, so but neither have I. So. Problems. Good tip. I'm trying to answer wrong, and I keep answering right. What the fuck? Oh, jeez. So we're at a strip club. Are we going to try to, like, talk to a stripper? I'm guessing. Yeah, I guess so. I feel like that never But ideally, works. really? You want to pick up, <laughs> would you really want to pick up a, a stripper? I don't know. I, I, I wouldn't be able to deal with the insecurities of her touching different guys every night. You know? Well, I, mean, I don't know. I mean... I'm not judging. I'm just saying it's I just couldn't judge that. It's too. a yeah. It's a. It's a if matter you have no of, insecurities and you're fine, as long as the girl's coming back home to you and you have yeah. no problem, then fine. I'm sure that's a pretty difficult but situation. But me no. There's plenty of guys that do it though. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It's very nice. It's like a nice strip club. I can't. I. I the fancy I'm, one. High end one it looks like. At least she's dressed. Yeah, no, we, don't, we don't have to censor most of this video now. Yes. <laughs> what was this game rated against? I probably am. It's probably for language, but I wouldn't think for sexuality, right? Because it's, it's trying to help you yes, pick people up. It's a little bit weird approaching and then you're not going to have a dance. And it's like, well, why were you approaching me? And yeah, so better to let her uh, make that first step. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. My name is Amber. Nice to meet you, Amber. Nice to meet you too. Guys, uh, I reckon you should pick a more slutty name. I mean, no. she's not. I mean, he's not wrong if you want to be a good stripper, but no. Um, it ask if she chose that stage name for a special. Oh my reading. God, E. What is this? E is just your oh. stripper. Uh, say, listen, darling, we know it's not. That's not your real name. So cut the crap. I'm not gonna say it like a '40s accent. Listen, darling. You know it's not the real name, so cut the crap. <laughs> I don't know. This is some weird. Um, a C D. Okay, no, we got weird. it. We got it. Connect with her by telling her your mom's no, stripper mom name was, was Amber as well. And, uh, yeah, her name was Amber as well, actually. <laughs> cool, right? I don't know. If that's the right answer. Uh, in fact, she still is a stripper. Sometimes. Wow! Wow! <laughs> Oh my god. I think his mom was there. He like covered his face and ran away. This <gasps> would be super embarrassing. Mm-hmm. Wow. I'm not like sitting here filing nails. You can do me after. What's with that guy? <laughs> also our friend. <laughs> so okay, all right. right. Um the stage name for a special reason, I Years guess. Years ago, I had dated a dancer, and she told me that she chose her stage name because it had some special meaning to her. It had some spiritual connection. So, did you choose the name Amber for any special reason? Uh, yes, I did. Uh, when I was a child, my granny gave me an Amber necklace. So oh, okay. Amber means a lot to me. And that's why, because it was from your granny. Yeah. Okay. That's a nice story. Yes, great idea to use the word stage name. It keeps it professional. As opposed to... Stripper name? Stripper name. Not so good. So. Not so good. And I think it's a nice name and my favorite type of stone. Ah, uh, actually, it's not a stone. It's fossilized tree resin. Oh, interesting. I didn't know. Ask her if she's ever performed fellatio for money. Um, Ooh, very no. direct. Tell her you approve of her name as it is subtle. Tell her some interesting facts about Amber. Well, Amber is cheap, so I think you've just... Wow. Oh, that God. That might be worse than the fellatio one. Yeah, that's, that's like an emotional... Like, yeah. I'm sure she's been asked for that like a million friggin' times. Uh, Okay, we'll see. I think it's great because it's subtle. And subtle is much more attractive. Too many girls, too full on. And I prefer something more real. Like if I was a stripper, you know what my name would be? What would it be? Stripper. Am I wrong? So that way, yeah. I'm Stripper the Stripper, so that there's no BS. I'm just going to get naked Very and that's nice, it. Uh, wow. Answer, you know, a, a lot of dancers have less subtle names, let's say. So, um, Bubbles. Amber's quite a nice one, so why not, um, why not compliment her on that? Bonifa. <laughs> let's 
Please? <laughs> did, did you redo? <laughs> Just came, I'm waiting for my friend Mahmoud. Oh no, please don't oh, tell no. me he's back. No, don't tell me he's coming back. I had some stress with uh, Cuphead, so I just came here to relax. And by the way, what's your name? Oh wow, okay. Okay, uh, my name is Richard, but you can call me Dick, Big <laughs> Dick. I knew a, a manager at my old job where it would be like, his name was Rich and he was like 80 million years old. I'll I'll be like, what, what up, yeah. Big Dick? Oh my god. <laughs> Play for tell her playfully tell her son of her business. Play hard to get by telling her you are not attracted to her. That's oh, that? no, no. What's a no? What's a no? No. My name yeah. is Richard, but my stage name is Ravinda. That gives you humor. Yeah, I guess you will hit the mic one more my time, bro. Richard, but my stage name is Ravinda. It's a mystical god of wisdom. Yeah, see, yeah, she's laughing. Yeah, see. Yeah, you seem very wet. Oh, thank you. Do you <clears> like the name? I like it. That's the right answer. It's a little moment, little joke that you can you can have any time. I think the uh, dancers have probably heard it before, but it's still pretty funny. And it puts you on the same level with her, doesn't it? Ah, you both you have a stage yeah. name. There's some common ground. Mm. Are you a band player? Obviously, you work in a band or have some other serious office job. Is it the girl that stripper was wearing? She was wearing like a looks like a two piece outfit and then like a one freaking bathing suit on top yeah, of it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> See, look at this. Look what she's wearing. What the fuck is oh, that? Yeah. <laughs> that is weird, yeah. <laughs> Let her sit on your lap so you can get a better view of oh her boobagi, booba, boob, boobage. Uh, tell her just to sit next to you. <laughs> Immediately friend zone her, I guess. Let her sit on your lap for a while while telling her she's squashing your balls. Or tell her she better not because you'll come in your pants. Um, wow. G is not the answer. Uh, <clears throat> guess A. <laughs> it's kind of obvious. Like, yeah, I mean. To progress the if you story. Tell her, if you tell the other thing. I guess just don't tell her that's yeah. what it's for. Let me see. Come on, no. what are you doing? Let me have a little taste. It didn't. <laughs> It didn't say you were gonna do that though. Uh, the fuck? I'm here. Pervert. Normal, yeah? <laughs> That's why I'm here. <laughs> First of all, it didn't say you were gonna go for her right licking one. thing. Wow. You just gotta feed him grapes now. Um, and then tell her she's squishing your balls, I guess, would be uh, the, the right one. Listen, uh, it's kind of squishing my balls. Do you mind? Sorry. Are they okay? Yeah, it should be alright. Yeah, it's okay. That, no, I don't, I don't know if that was... Okay. That could be funny, right? <laughs> that could actually be funny, yeah. It could be funny. <laughs> she didn't find that <laughs> funny. I don't think she found that she funny. Depends depends on that all the time. She takes it. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Don't be upset. Nothing personal. Don't you like my body? Oh, wow. I'll tell her that she's too good for this trip. Here we go. There we go. I'm gonna take you away from all this. Listen, Amber, you're too good for this place. <laughs> shit off. We need to get you out of here. What are we gonna do? What are you talking about? Wait, wait, That's a bit I strong. I didn't think I was gonna say it like you that. You come and work for me. I give you a new job, and you need to live with me. We need to get you out of here. Look at all these fucking guys and this I horrible my job. job. No, yeah, I know you need to say that because they might be listening. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Oh, oh. Why do you take everything to the house. max? Sleep in my bed, I'll sleep in the bathroom. <laughs> I'll sleep. Right, babe, I'm gonna save you from this no, shit. No, no, no. Don't worry. I'm scared. Wait, I'm no. gonna take you away no, from all of this, Amber. Stay with me. Wow, no, wow. Don't wow. Stay with me. Stay with me, love. No, no. Where are you going? Hey. <laughs> you're doing? It's a chance. <laughs> you're Why do you take it to the max? He just took it to the max. It's straight out. They must have a passport. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my this god! Sense, I think. Yeah. So why didn't it work? Wait, is he feeding her sleep. cake? Feeding him cake? Wow, he's feeding cook I okay. cake. Um, just tell her how beautiful she is. Tell her she's sexy, but you are into the entire package, not just the looks. That's a nice thing to say. Yeah. Of course, you're very sexy, but for me, it's about the entire package, not just looks. I need to find someone character sex. there we go proper and answer don't you find that sex is so much more powerful when you have a deep connection with someone oh uh, yeah, wow he I'm didn't also looking for a deep connection and huh? it's very important that's very forward 
is good, then we have that in common. This is a great way to start because she probably gets approached by the way she looks quite regularly. Exactly. So saying that you want something more is quite intriguing. And yeah, I think someone in that kind of job, uh, same with modeling, I guess, uh, you don't want to be recognized only for your looks. You know, I work at nights and all these beautiful girls, men look at me and sometimes I feel really... Jesus! Oh, yeah. Hey, now what? Let me ask you something. Yeah? What was the best sex you ever had? Oh, Jeez! These answers better be fat, freaking hilarious. Turn her then, move the conversation away, get into her about telling about sex, tell her she ain't know nothing good about sex until she... What kind of answers are these? My God! <laughs> oh my God! All right. All right. All right. Uh, let's talk. Let's just talk about sex. Yeah, because if it gets too gross, we'll edit some of this out. Oh God! I think it was this um, girl I dated. She's called Margaret, and she just had this amazing ass. And I was just <sighs> Margaret. You know, I talked to her, and I was just thinking, it's gonna be great. You know, and we got back, and I was like, That's okay, a good stripper name, Margaret. Time, obviously, but we have to do it, doggy. You never see it coming. Oh, she's amazing. Take off her thing and she had this little pussy no, that looks so nice. Just oh, to the bed. bang, bang, bang. I don't know, like 15 minutes. I don't think she was into that. Her boobs. Not as nice as your I don't know why she would ask about what? sex and yeah, then be surprised she... when he talks about oh, sex. It, like Granted, he's getting maybe a she bit. maybe she wanted the other answer. Change a few positions. In the end, she sucked me off. It was so cool. I don't know if that's the best sex I ever had, but it was one of. One of the best ones. That's not a good sex experience. Okay. I think it's not. Yeah. You get the point. Yeah, 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 yeah I got it. Yeah. Such a, yeah. yeah. Oh, man, she's sexy. You should have ended it, but you know what I should call Wait, it. Wait, what? That wasn't a right answer? Women that can bring up the subject of sex or talk about sex, uh, you don't want to shy away from that because that could look like, you know, you just can't handle yourself or she's too much for you. Um, but conversely, you don't want to get really into it, so it's kind of... I didn't uh, think he was going to get that deep about it. I really didn't. It, half of this is his fault. Yeah. Sure, and he goes, goes into it too far, too, like... Because presumably lots of people talk to her about <clears throat> sex on a nightly basis, so... Yeah. You want to differentiate yourself from other people? Yeah. Right, I hope you get to redo that answer, because that was... I don't think so. The other clients. You know what? I study business. Oh, yeah? And I want to have my own business in the future. And also, I want to be a Twitch streamer. Oh, my God. What? Cool. But Tell you she are has one, a good now. chance because she's not <laughs> Yeah, keep hitting the mic there, Alex. <laughs> Encourage her to... <laughs> I can't. You know what? I don't know you Some of these well, things are too mean to say. Achieve your goals. But he does Twitch. Why did he say I do Twitch? Yeah, I'm sure you'll be happy and have your own business and be a top Twitch streamer. Should all come true. Thanks. Thank you for your support. Anytime. You like that one? Yeah, I like that one. The thing is, um, it was an opportunity to kind of say, okay, you know, let's get that more precise, let's understand that a little bit more, okay, give some advice or yeah. something, yeah. And to just say, yeah, I believe in you, that's cool. Yeah, it's that's maybe a little bit too easy. Yeah, I agree, I agree. Listen, hmm. do you think it's time for a dance? Hmm. <laughs> Send that other girl over. <laughs> <laughs> These are so mean. I know. <laughs> oh my god. Let's, um, let's not do it here, though. Let's go to the private area. Yeah, yeah let's go. Come on. Oh no. Let's see how the champagne goes. room. Let's see There's how this no goes. sex in the champagne room, as Chris Rock told us back in the day. Where? Have you ever heard that song? What? There's no sex in the champagne room. Oh, oh look. I never heard that song. But... Oh, okay. Oh, we don't have to watch the dance. <sighs> Thank god. It's pretty good. So our strip club experts in New York actually say that it's all right to have some dances, um, but they're quite rich, so that's all right. And then our guys in London who don't like spending so much money, uh, they say you don't need to. So uh, it really depends. You can do hmm. it both ways. Obviously, if you've got loads of cash, fine. If you have doesn't it take you out of, you know, you're not there on a professional 
you know, you're not there being professional with her on a client. It takes you back into the client zone if you have a dance from her. Yeah, I, I think that. I mean, it does, um, it does change the dynamic a little yeah. bit. But there's something where you recognise that she's got to work. So you're like, well, I find you beautiful and I'll pay for the dances. And while you're dancing, okay. I'll talk to you and get to know you. And we'll then sit down, have a drink, then maybe have another dance. And it at least shows that um, you're generous you know, and that you appreciate her physically. But it's, it's a... It's um, yeah, dodgy, dodgy yeah. Mm-hmm. potentially. I don't know about that one. Are you always mm. here or do you have a chance to travel sometimes? I do travel sometimes, yeah. That's good. And where's your favourite place? My favourite place is Cyprus. It has very beautiful nature and nice people. Okay, and how do you feel when you're there? I feel very relaxed and like at home. Just happy. You know what? Have you been to Barcelona? No. I think you would love it there. Because it has the sea, mm. surrounded by mountains, so you can you know, always be in nature. But then you've got the city nearby, lovely food. You should definitely go. I think it's your kind of place. Yeah, it is. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's oh my god. Uh, uh, all right, let's find out her real name. I don't want to know if she has cocaine. Listen, I can't. It realistically, she would have gotten yelled at by her manager mm-hmm. by now to get dancing, but whatever. Yeah. My name is Jenny. Jenny? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I feel like that's not her real name. I think this is the right time to find her real name. Uh-huh. Yeah, if you ask in the beginning, it's, uh, it's too early. You know, it is quite personal because obviously she's using her stage name to kind of protect her from stalkers and. <laughs> You know, being on that personal level, but by now it's already time, and you can. You do look like a Jenny, actually. What do you mean? I'm not gonna say yet, but don't worry, it's something good. Hmm. So since you know my real name, I'm gonna tell you what's on my mind. Okay. Mm-hmm. My dream is to open a dog rescue center. Oh, that's nice. Tell her a story about cats. Uh, tell her about when you went fox hunting, cause uh. Yeah, they're in. No. Let's just go ahead and connect on it. The rescue center would be great because, you know, so many people these days are just selfish and they don't do anything to make the world a better place. But if you care about animals, you should really do it, you know? And that's fantastic. Well done. Thank you. Listen, look, I saw earlier the barman here is pretty good, isn't he? He made some nice cocktails. Yeah. So, so. Uh, if you're ready for a break, why don't we go have a drink? I'll buy you a drink. Yeah. That's yeah? Good. yeah? All right, cool. Because I'm still waiting for my mood, but. He's really late. Hopefully He's never coming. Hopefully he doesn't fucking show up. Cocktail. Fuck my mood. What's your favorite cocktail? Uh, old fashioned. So moving the action to the bar is nice. It's kind of like a mini date. You know, you're in this environment and you're saying, okay, let's go over there together for a moment. Yeah, it's a nice way to get to know her as well. Do you spend a lot of time with yeah. him? And not and like... What should we get? Whiskey sour? I don't know. Hey, man. Can we get two whiskey sours, please? Thanks she just much. said she liked old fashioned, and then you order a whiskey yeah, sour. Um, actually, I like living in the city, but sometimes I miss my family back home. Oh, yeah? You're all alone here? Yeah. That's quite hard, right? Because you come like to be an independent woman and do your work, do all your stuff. But of course, family is so important, yeah? So it must be tough. Yeah, it's really difficult. But still exciting. <laughs> and what's for you important? Uh, say you're very flexible, not interested in anything, you share some of your passion, you make very clear statements about what you want from life. I don't see just want to play video games and fuck girls, you know what I mean? Uh, assume that she obviously wants to fuck and cut to the chase. Uh, uh, I'm gonna say B, I mean C. Yeah, C looks like a good That's an interesting question. I think that for me, life is all about finding the balance, the balance between the things that you need to do, like working, earning money, all of that you know, rubbish, and then the things that you should do, the things that you love to do, the things that are good for you know, your friends and family, that make the world a better place. So I think for me, the most important thing is finding that balance to make sure, you know, like now my phone is not ringing, I try to keep it on silent and to, to have, you know, like a real connection with people. And then I think, you know, I'll be happy. That's 
that's the right answer. Uh, speaking okay. passionately Woo-hoo! about something is actually attractive <laughs> uh, for a guy to do. At least I think so. What do you think, Charlotte? Absolutely. If you can talk passionately about your but yet when we were talking about Fortnite job, with the other guy, that was wrong. Your, your passionate God. kind of person. It draws people in and gives them that kind of She admitted of to being a gamer energy, there. So, yeah, so right. She did, yeah. She's, yeah. Actually, I'm quite hungry. So why don't you order something? You want some food? Uh, I'm not going to eat when I'm working. No? No. Okay, well, what kind of food do you like? I like Italian food, like pasta maybe. Oh, uh, really? Well, yeah. So does everyone Italian. else. Oh, yeah. Speaking of which, My I want to tell you now. She lives in the south of Italy. Uh, this mic's yeah, too close to us. <laughs> fresh pasta sauce. Sorry, if I talk about it, I'll make you even more hungry. But it's yeah. really, really good. Mm. I'm sure strip strip clubs uh, spaghetti is pretty good. So just <laughs> so just meaning for get the fish, get the fish. <laughs> yeah, gotta get the folio fish. You say, listen, I'm really horny, so why don't you at least suck me off in the toilet? Whoa. Um. But, oh, that's grammatically wow. incorrect. You should say, suck me off. I guess by the toilet or in the stall because it would be inside of the toilet. Whatever. Talk about what food you like. I think I'm in love with you. Would you like to be my girlfriend? Oh, I'm going to say, hey, wow. that a good idea. Good. One night when you're not working, we could go out for a nice dinner. Go to a cool Italian place, have some wine, some pasta. Some pasta. Really good. What do you think? Yeah, it sounds nice. All right, great. All she's right. cool with it. That should be it now, right? We got this now. In her court again. You're leaving it up to her to understand that work is important but it's on her terms yeah and a dinner is probably quite a good date in this situation good one to suggest i'm enjoying your company actually so we should keep in touch why don't you give me your number <gasps> no. of course i will give you my number okay we did good we did okay. good i'll record her you <laughs> Enter your, your phone? Oh, uh, yeah, trust. just enter your phone. Right? <laughs> All right, babe. Well, great. So, here you go. Put your number in my no, phone. No, no, no. You're not allowed to do, do that here. No. no, it's fine. Of course you go. No, no, no. What? Hey, man, what? what? Baby, come on. Help me. Oh. Baby. She's trying to be oh, subtle under the radar. Oh, I didn't. Oh, see? There we go. Two guys that have never been to a... So, strip. this is a no I did not know you could do that at the circle. If she handles your phone, then the bouncers are going to not like it because yeah. it's against the rules. Yeah. No rule breakers. Oh, Look at this that. guy. This guy's like, he's like. Oh, okay. Yeah, All right. Yeah. So I guess memor- memorize it. Look, I know you'll get in trouble if someone sees you. Give me your number. So just tell me. Yeah, because yeah. of prostitution. Oh, yeah, because they don't want to classify as that. Nine five five. Okay. Seven two. Mm-hmm. One one. Okay, I've got it. Great. I'll message you later. That seems so risky. Not the best thing. Oh, God, we guess record it then? What do you mean by record it? Like, oh, like, like pull out your phone and, like, phone. act like... Mm-hmm. Um, 291670790. Oh. Two. Oh, fuck, I didn't know they were making this. Ah! This one? Yep. Were you paying attention? I was mm-hmm. like, Congratulations. Oh, I told you to pay attention. I'm very good at <laughs> stuff like that. I really did remember the number, so nice one. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Show. God, when yeah. are we going to be freaking like... The, oh, when I stop That's fucking right around. Uh, when I, once I stop fucking around. <laughs> oh, we had a... Oh, we're at a freaking... As long as there's no Muhammad, we're all good. Mahmoud. Mahmoud. Remember that dick's name. So... Oh, it's girl. Uh, it's yeah, girl picking up no, guys now. He's nice. He's a possibility. I yeah. think. Let's find out. We're not. Uh, you know, big plans for the night. I'm definitely ready to have some fun. Oh, here's to that. <laughs> oh, we're playing as. Okay, so we're playing as open. Okay, look pissed off. So you're like you're playing hard to get. Smile a lot and look around the room. Walk up to a guy, grab his dick, and oh show God. social dominance. Loudly ask, "So what are? So what? Are there any real men in here?" Oh my God! Well, um, I can make a strong case for B, but I think we're gonna say uh, C. <laughs> yeah. So now we're seeing girl behavior now. Women behavior, Gregory. These are women. <laughs> Well, actually, we are the women now, so... Yeah, so it's... 
Do they have to show us them smiling and looking around the room, or can't they just? Can we just assume that's what they're doing and then skip this? Oh, I don't know. Oh my god! Sorry, women. Any women that are watching. Yeah, we're. Um, these women are just are. Way this this couple game is, this game is way over the top at every couple of knuckleheads. There are a few so options remember we picked. Normally, oh, women that are looking to be approached more will kind of look every time someone new comes into the bar. Um, they'll make eye contact more and they'll be less interested in their friends and more interested in what's going on in the venue. So you should have pushed yeah, your friend aside and then started dancing by yourself, is what they're saying. And be in the center of the room so they can be approached more. Mm -hmm. Huh. How would that make it easier to approach a person in the center? Wouldn't that be like a dance? Floor? You know what scares the scary thing is? I just went, came back from a wedding over the weekend. Uh -huh. And a girl was doing that, staring at me the entire time at the wedding. Nobody and was fucking and I didn't say, No, seriously. Yeah? Yeah. Look at, I didn't say anything, I didn't do anything. Sit didn't, on a bar I, stool I, I with legs wide around. open? Is that what she did at the at the wedding? She was sitting at the bar with no. her legs wide open? No, I couldn't okay. Then that. guess what? She wasn't. She didn't fucking care about you. Uh, <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'm not that gutsy anymore. Anyway, your body so I never got through anyway. So uh, I guess open to the room, right? So, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Wanna, if you face each other, they might think because then they'll seem like they're together. Yeah. They're together, together. Apart, then guys might come. And... I mean, sometimes I get nervous about my dancing, but oh, what, what's this going on here? Are we already getting the yeah. See, they're yeah, fun. telling you. They're they telling fun. you what. No, I think we're about to hear that part now. Obviously, there's a physical aspect. Okay, yeah, yeah. So He's explaining often, that um, women will start. So I think the music of, was so loud. Uh, looking at each other, but with their body turned out to make them more approachable, more visible, and also you can pay attention to their feet. If their feet hmm. point um, out towards the room, that's actually an indicator. And if they're very focused on each other, then they probably are less likely to want to be bothered in that moment. Hmm. You learn something Makes sense. Mm -hmm. But this, the thing is, in the moment, to be honest with you, those small little cues don't get picked up by most yeah, people. Yeah, kind of so like, check it out. You have to like be very obvious and open. Now, now she just literally looks like she's just searching. So, <laughs> to get even more attention. Twerk on your friend. Scream fire fire to clear the dance floor of competition. Uh, sing loudly or just close and pray. I don't know. I mean, I'm not. <laughs> um. Okay. Uh. Well, fire fire is illegal, yeah. so yeah. I'm not sure there's a there's a police aspect to that. On your friend, I don't know. I mean, I've seen. Um. That screams. I feel like I don't. I mean, I just close and pray. Sing loudly is probably not. Sing loudly. Who's gonna hear you? Yeah. I guess just close and, and crimp your hair. I wonder if there's a guy that she's looking. There was at. one guy that approached her. Yeah. Everyone's in dresses, and there's that one lady in a shirt and. So there's the old famous indicator of interest, you know, if the woman touches her hair. Oh yeah, see. All okay. women touch their hair though, so it's not necessarily. An what if they got a scratchy ass head? Or got a like bug bite in their head? Or a headless. Or if it's right <laughs> after <laughs> you have eye contact, yes. then it's probably a real one. And I think if they're flicking it off their skin, if they're trying to show mm. more skin, is this a good one? I think mm. so. Sure. That's for the neck type people that like necks. Your John Wayne Gacy's and other serial killers that are really in their necks. Oh, here we go. Look at this dude. This. Hi. How are you? Yeah, I'm really good. Good. Oh, that is really loud. You're talking really, really loud. I'm Camille. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> so where are you from? From England. Oh, I'm from Israel. I've always wanted to go to Israel. Always. You're most welcome. Thank you. I feel like it's certainly like dangerous. Okay. Thanks. So, you look like a really nice girl. You guys can't see this, yeah. but me and Greg are freaking yeah. dancing. Can I have your number? <laughs> Hmm, 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 hmm. Wait, what happened? He asked for her number. Oh, uh, really like That's a bit forward. Here, put it in. Uh, dismiss. Use Adam line and. Oh, so now this is the this, so this is the scenario with the other way. Uh, I guess use. No, no, this is still him. How to reject him? 
You could be yeah. rude. I wouldn't be rude about it. Can I give you a test? Sure. Yeah, it's just a test of your coordination. Yeah, Okay. Not? Okay. Phone in your pocket. This. Okay. Hands like this. And you're what? going to me. Okay, you go one, two, three, four. Really fast. Up to ten. Wait, what? Okay. Try it. What? One, two, three. Okay, okay. Now you do it with your eyes closed. Keep them closed. Up to ten. Okay? Okay. okay. Oh, she's going to walk away. <laughs> I knew it! Good shit! That's probably the best way to do it. Because. You're gonna be rude or you can just disappear. Uh, what? Cool. Uh, this is my friend Adam Lyons' move. Um, he has a dating really? group called Psychology Hacker, a YouTube <laughs> channel and stuff. And we worked together. I don't know, about 10 years ago in London, and he showed this really funny move and good way to uh, get rid of a guy in this situation, but you could also use it um, as a man in a dating situation with a woman uh, just to have a little bit of fun. I mean, granted, he could just be rude. Who gives a shit? That guy was rude. Yeah. Was jump. Well, I got rid of it. Wow. That was fun. <laughs> you weren't even friggin' paying attention. This is so awkward. Yeah, I know this because is so weird. like I don't know these some of these cues are just they're making me feel like I'm a better wow. dancer than I am though. That's my friend there. Oh. I haven't seen him in ages. Oh, go, oh, go, 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 go. Yeah, I'll be back, okay? Yeah, I get it. The shot of the, the glass and everything is really nice. Here we go, next guy, right? Stop. <gasps> my god! Don't you look stunning? Oh my god. Thank you. you What's with like the walking, duffel bag? All these guys make us look bad. They really do. We're not, they're, we're not like this well, at all. Well, let's just say, well, life. no, well, there are a lot yeah. of us, so let's just. I'm Louise. I don't know. Louise, this is just nice such. Yeah? What's your name? It's Fraser Cranwell II. Nice to meet you. Pleasure to meet you. Come well the second. What? Oh, you know, a couple of pheasants I shot this morning. Oh my god, this is kind of... Oh my god. It's the worst people to ever come up to you. James Parkinson, Roly Poly. I know him, good friend of mine. I hope we figure out a nice way to tell him the fuck off. What do you do for a living, Cromwell? What do you mean? A job? Oh, he's royalty. Um, tell him he can do anything to you sexual, pretend to be upper class, and start touching him. Oh my god. Oh, you actually oh, want to be with this guy why? because you're a girl and you want the money. Uh, you know, That's uh, not great. This is not This is not the right scenario. Jeez. Ah, tell him he's got to fuck off. What is he, fucking Superman oh, taking off his glasses, yeah, revealing his real identity? What the fuck is this? What is this game? Oh, um, no. Oh. Oh, stunning. Stunning. Isn't that the he likes this? Funnily enough, like, I was in the royal box that Prince Harry and... You are joking. You know Harry. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna get called up for lying now. Oh, oh! What? What? Cheers. Here's to a lovely evening. Uh, I mean... Cheers. What? Well done. You've got the right option. What? What? Hold on. Scam the guy? Cheers. So Good. tell me, my darling, what would your idea of romance be? Well, I suppose, um, fine dining, nice holidays abroad, the odd really expensive gift here and there. Really? Know? Nice. Just Casual, this is making women like and men look bad. Yeah. Oh my god. Uh, you know, What's with no this game? Places, like Marisha, Seychelles. Um, Are you a fan of Milan? You know what, darling? I don't mind saying this. I'm becoming terribly fond of you. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. This guy is incredibly, incredibly... Okay, take him to the bathroom for a quick shag. Do the oh classic no. headbutt dance. What? 
Oh, this is just me. What, what's a headbutt dance? Uh, I have this no is idea. Be, this is going to be curiosity. What is headbutt dance? I really like you. And how would you feel about a little dance? Oh. Come on, we're at a club. You can dance, Oh, right? if I must, yeah. <laughs> really? Love a man that can dance. Ooh, naked. Oh. Show me some moves. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, what? Headbutt him. Headbutt him. Headbutt him. Yes! <laughs> what? Is that, yeah. the, is that the headbutt dance? <laughs> I had no idea what that was. No, 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 no. no. He was being really creepy. There you go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> This game! Oh my god! Oh. Wait, wait. Well done. Uh, you're in trouble now. Yeah. <laughs> Again, he's feeding him cake, and the guy's petting his head. It's tiramisu. Oh god, suggest a right, meeting. Alright, so. God. Yeah. Not gonna go well, bang really him in the bathroom. You like me. I'm, I'm, I like you too, but I'd, I'd like to get to know you better. Well, how about we finish these and I'll take you for a 14 course taster menu at La Travion. Well, that would be wonderful, and I would, but I'm a lady and I like to. Say no more. I could not respect that more. And I do pride myself on being a gentleman. Take my details. And don't be bandying this around because I'm an eligible bachelor. Okay? It says, look, eligible, eligible bachelor. Oh my oh god, my. really? Oh, I want to murder this actor for signing on to play he's, this freaking He's almost as bad off. as the other guy. I think, if, me, won't you? I think this is making yeah, you will. kind of shoo off the assholes well, first. Um, it has been yeah. an honor, a privilege, and a pleasure. And he's I not the you. worst, but, no. he's, but he's very... His personality yeah. is a fucking shit little shit bird right there. Who walks around with two dead birds in his fucking bag? I thought the whole thing with uh, lying about Prince Harry thing nice would get you in trouble. Maybe it's maybe it's true. I have no idea. Guy would be better, uh, you know, to go on a date later. He would take her to a super fancy restaurant yeah, and nice. wine and dine her, and he can be, you know, maybe he'll even take her shopping and mm. take her to Lucky for some. watch the polo or something. <laughs> Did you chat any guys while I was away? Yeah, well, yeah. She's not gonna tell a friend about him. Nothing? No, it's for her. Yeah. <laughs> He's mad. <laughs> Are there any guys that you really like here? Anyone else? What about that guy? He's handsome. The Looks hell? Like a model. <clears throat> Hmm. He kind of looks like a serial killer. So I'm going to say... <laughs> you're going to say yes, aren't you? I'm going to say no. Oh, okay. Guy, I think going to be... No. He looks like... I'm trying to think of the serial killer. Bane. He'd be up his own ass. No. Think so? He looks like Richard Ramirez. That's what he looked like. <laughs> cool. Uh, oh, that's the right option. Oh. And, you know, it's funny the difference in the way women and men approach things. So men obviously are very visual, like we, we know. Uh, but women often wouldn't be attracted to that kind of model-looking guy. And especially in this situation where he looks boring and bored. Yeah, well, well besides the serial killer stuff. Women yeah. might think they're attracted to model-looking guys on paper. But for me, it's definitely about the spark and the chemistry and the personality when you get there. And if they're looking boring... I don't want to waste my time. There's also a theory that if the guy is uh, less attractive, um, he's willing to kind of go the extra mile in the bedroom. And the Fine. model guy would just be like, I've got an amazing body. Jesus. I don't really need to do much. Oh, okay, ah, I never need it. Hmm. It's terrible. Oh, shit. It's my song. <laughs> uh, what about that guy? Looks funny. He looks like a... Uh, oh, he's... No, fuck him. He's fucking <laughs> he looks so drunk. drunk. <laughs> he's so drunk. That one. <laughs> he looks like a... Oh. So drunk he can't even stand up. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well... No. Yeah. 
Oh. God. Sorry. Yep, yeah, obviously the right option. Uh, <laughs> I wonder what happened if you said yes. Gonna... You're just talking to a passed out drunk guy. Oh, <laughs> Look yep. at the bar. That's clear. <laughs> oh my god. What? Right? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of looks like uh, Pennywise. <laughs> oh, yeah, now yes is on the left. I wonder if that's the right answer or not. Yeah. Yes, he is. Whoa. She's so dramatic. Like, yeah, yeah, I've been waiting all night. Oh, yeah. Yeah. She's yeah. Making. yeah. Oh, my God. My nan would love him. <sighs> what? I need to so good in a gimp mask. Oh my god, what the fuck? Dude, that's a gimp mask. Her friend. Are you serious? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> These girls are out of control. What the fuck? She's still like evil. She's like, eh, like. No? It's the wrong choice if you want to get laid. Exactly. Because he's too nice. Oh, I'm trying to get laid. So. Oh. I guess the, the drunk guy would have been, I guess. No. So. Oh, so we're actually trying to. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, all right, all right. I always forget. Okay. Breakfast. He wouldn't last five minutes. No. Oh my God, this dancing. Oh, Jesus Christ. This girl's like he's looking for people and it's like. Yeah, that's the right option. And you know, shy guys out there often miss the opportunities. I've been out lots of times with um, clients that want to improve their dating skills, and they will often be talking to a woman. Everything's going great. And then they get her number and leave, and they say she was a bit cold in the end. And I said, well, obviously she at least wanted to kiss you, and she was kind of sending all those signals. But they just didn't pick up on it? They missed it, yeah. So, um, the nice yeah, guy. I'm the nice guy. She's last in that case. Mm. That's me. Yeah. That's why everyone hates me. I'm always a dating type. I'm not the well, we're trying one to dating this so. thing. Yeah. No. Oh, of course, <laughs> of course, it's Richard. Uh, That's yes, 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 yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. He's quite good looking. He's oh my god. Oh my this god. This just feeding his ego on this one. Oh my god. Yeah, he just picked the this right scenario for himself. The right amount of crazy. Music, oh my god. Well, you don't like repetitious music? This is not nice. this repetitious, my god. Boom, there you go. Obviously, the right decision. Obviously, yeah, it's you. I'm the man for the job. That's me. Yeah, apparently so. Mm hmm. Jeez. Music does change in clubs. And it's just over and over. Jesus. Ah, oh, that. At least he's dressed better, except for the white hey. blazer. Hey! How you doing? I saw, yeah, good. I saw you with that guy, um, Cranwell, whatever he is. That, uh, posh knob, you know? Oh, he's, he's just a friend. There's such funny rumors about that guy that you can't get it up. It's still, anyway, I'm saying too much. <laughs> Whoa, oh, my God! Oh. Oh, he's throwing his friend on that bus. Oh funny. my god. Caddy as shit. Oh, here we go. Roll your eyes and say, nice line, asshole. Do I look like an idiot to you? Laugh and say, maybe. See if she, see if he likes some slap and a tickle. I'm going to say, see, because I'm pretty sure slap and a tickle is sex stuff. Maybe, but you obviously noticed me too. <laughs> Maybe it's good enough for me. And yeah, of course I noticed you. Do you know why? Too bright as shit dress. You hold that strong, confident eye contact. Oh, jeez. I like a confident woman. Oh, God. This guy. This guy is nuts. Nice one. That's the right option. It's kind of the right middle ground. A little mm -hmm. bit playful. You know, I really like your style. You, you look really cool, and I like a man who dresses well. 
Thanks so much. Anybody that looks like they belong in a boat, I guess. I'm Richard, by the way. Oh, I'm Louise. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Uh, tell him he is great and you slept with way worse guys. That's uh... <laughs> Tell him you're a virgin. I'm pretty sure that's not the oh, answer. Sorry. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So, Richard, um, quick question. Can you give me three qualities that separate you from all the other club guys out there? Yeah? Yeah. You know, that's the question I normally ask girls. So we've got that in common, but let me think. Well, I'm actually oh. honest. You are I'm so not honest. honest. <laughs> I'm quite kind, mostly to strangers though. And I'm decisive. When definitely I like decisive. I get it. That's a good, yeah. Yeah, he's definitely decisive, let me tell you right now. Cool, that's the right option. It's a little bit of a challenge and yeah, having fun in this situation is, is totally cool. And it might give her, him an opportunity to ask her two qualities as well. Mm -hmm. And then you should have a good response ready. That goes for basically any question you ask, right? You yep. need to have your response ready. You can't go, uh, I don't know. <coughs> really, can you? That's know. normal. That's, that's most know. girls that I know. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, shit, they're playing my song again. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking talk, stop dancing. Jesus. Oh, here we go. Show him your cat, <laughs> cat woman. What the fuck is a cat woman? Is he gonna do the just the meow thing? Yeah, probably. See if he will buy you a bottle of champagne. That's not cool. How many how many times can you do it? I guess. Wow, he, I don't know. I guess cat woman. You like comic books, yeah? I like the Marvel movies, yeah. So you like Catwoman? <laughs> uh, That's DC! DC. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. What the hell? But all guys love Catwoman, right? She's really sexy, yeah. yeah right. Oh, I'm glad you said that. I do the best Catwoman impression in the world. Right, yeah. What's the Catwoman impression? Uh, oh, that's the Catwoman. Yeah, I guess that is too. Wow. Hang on a second. Let me show you my Batman impression. No, nope, no. Nope. Show you my Batman impression. What's this? You ready? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> my God. Yeah. What? <laughs> what the Ooh. fuck? I did not expect that. I did not expect that. So that was too strong and too frisky then, huh? <laughs> I can't. Oh. That, are you gonna do it again? Nah. Okay. All okay. Right. I guess. I guess the bottle of champagne. I'm so thirsty. Um, you got some drink there? Yeah, but I want something better, like maybe a bottle of champagne. Oh, bottle. Sure. Why not? No, it's just not as either. Listen, darling, finish your drink, and I'll be thirsty in a minute from all this dancing. We can go and get a drink of something, but probably not champagne. Oh, okay. Oh, so it's in an innuendo of some sort. No, that's the right option. And in this what? situation, you know, a woman is testing. So uh, she might tease him, and she might even give these quite strong teases. Uh, she might be overtly sexual, huh? and the whole point of all of that <sighs> is to see wow. whether he can handle all right. it. Because obviously, if he can't handle it, then he's not the man for her in this situation. It's kind of hard. <laughs> Whatever. If it works, it works, right? Richard, I don't know what your preconception of me is, but I, I, I don't normally look like this. Yeah, what do you look like? Well, this is my dark side. I mean, I'm. <sighs> oh I'm my god. As well. I'm all right. I'm doing my master's in forensic psychology. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. Wow. All right. Yeah. <clears throat> um, tease him about his phone or make sure he does... Okay, we got to Okay, who, who says that? What the fuck phone is that? He didn't 
say you're an antique dealer. Yeah. <laughs> what? What do you mean? Your phone's at oh, yeah, the flip phone. Yeah, that's why. Ah, uh, you caught me on that one. But I'm gonna get you back. Oh. Trust me. This guy looks oh, like he has really good the right cocaine. Answer. Quite a nice piece. Yeah. Um, girl actually did this to me once in real life in a club, and I was like, "That's actually pretty funny." She asked me if I had, um, if my phone was Winston Churchill's pocket. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's pretty good. You got me there. You oh got it good God. because you can play Snake on your phone. That's true. Even Snake Two. Yeah. Snake Two. Boom. You know, some guys really have no idea how to pull a girl. True. So sad. I mean, there was this lovely guy at the bar, and he's good looking, mm. nice guy. Do you know the line he said? Go on. He said, babe, I've lost my number. Do you mind if I borrow yours? <laughs> God, that's a classic. What are you yes. talking about? I've used that one before. When I was 14, 15. <laughs> Did you see her face when he first when he first said he's used it before? Behave funny. lewdly, compliment his lovely little legs. What? <laughs> we started to open him up now, so... Uh, uh, I guess lewdly, because I don't want to tell him you have another date. Oh, uh, his lovely hands? His lovely little hands, that's what I Oh. Saying. Little hands? Here we go. I don't know. Oh. This is, I love a confident man, you know? Oh, this is the wrong... This is the... Yeah, the confident one, one yeah. I guess they read the game, they forgot that's to take amazing. that out of subtitles. I'm not wearing any knickers, so, um... All right. Oh, they switched those two. Well, that's nice. Oh, delight that. What the fuck? Sorry. What the? Sorry, well, well, it's enough for now. It's enough for now. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> oh, my God. It's like the cowboy oh, scenario. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is terrible. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. She's, like, really trying, like... Jesus. That's what you get. Uh, uh, oh, lewd behavior. Oh. And then thrown out of the bar. Yeah. Okay. All Maybe right. He has complimented his little hands. He's got really nice hands for a guy. All right, thank you. They're really soft. <laughs> They're lovely. Yeah, I've got that uh, hand lotion, you know? Yeah, I'm sure you do. Wait. So, it's... in British terms, little doesn't mean Maybe? that. When you're thinking little, I'm thinking small. I'm not yeah, thinking. Maybe. Awesome. That's the right choice. Love it. <laughs> Fucking Brits. Yes. What plans you got for the week? I've been to the UK and they do some strange so terms, but. Family yeah. And, yeah, relax. Wicked. How about you? I've got work on Saturday, but Sunday I need to chill, so I'll probably have a massage or something. A massage. A massage. A massage. Maybe I'll get a massage. That's a great idea. When's it a bad idea? Get a group on. Oh, hey, man. How you doing? You alright? Oh wow, well, he's trying to jump in. He's trying to get in there. What's that all about? Did I tell you I work in pharmaceuticals? Ah. He's just selling coke, right? No, fuck that. Don't, don't hook up with a drug dealer ever. A weed dealer, you okay. I'm gonna invite you back to my place, but you're a right. fucking drug dealer. What do you mean? No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm just not. Just... fucking ad. You fucking kill people! Oh, hang on, I just oh my went... God. Oh, man. Oh, right, you're a drug yeah, but, dealer. No, a pharmaceutical. Oh. I'm not a drug dealer, everyone. You are a... Everyone is a drug dealer. Oh, not a drug dealer. Dealer! Not a drug dealer. <laughs> but antihistamine, if anyone wants something, whatever. Hay fever. Hay fever? No. Wow. That's so weird. That's so weird. What? what? You got hay fever? <laughs> yeah. That's good. Okay, I mean, in this one, she just wanted to get laid, and she could have found out why um, I had all the drugs, right? So. <laughs> okay, okay, all right. All right. I was going to invite you back to mine, but are you a drug dealer? <laughs> you know what? It doesn't even matter. No. Wait, wait. You're going back? No, no, hang on a minute. That guy's got severe, severe hay fever. He could die at any minute. So oh it's just extra strength. Extra, oh, extra, extra, extra so strength he's, he's going to bullshit you. Right. Cool. Better. And you don't right. care because... Because he's just trying to get laid. Yeah. I don't agree with... Do you have hay fever? Stop asking everybody whether they have hay fever. No, never.
Excellent. That's the right option. Is it though? I mean, is it? Is I he mean, actually the moral farmers... story here is? Oh, we got super sinister. Okay. I, I think That's the moral of the story is women that are looking to be be really messed up. More will kind of look every time someone new comes into the bar. Um, they'll make eye contact more, and they'll be less interested okay, sure. in their friends and more interested in what's going on in the venue. A lot of this, I think, has to do with the fact that we what? don't. What? I think a lot of it has to do with the fact that we don't know British culture, and the way the wording is. Oh, new ones, huh? Girl looking for a serious relationship. All right, <laughs> we're gonna continue doing this with some more of these missions. Uh... Yes, yeah, so we'll bring you more videos oh, of God. this game. This uh, game, I don't even know if it's a friggin' game at this point. This is some. This is or some life weird. stories, or <laughs> whatever this is. I some advice of mostly what not to do, since apparently we suck at it. Uh, please make sure to like and subscribe. Hit us up down below in the comments. Uh, like I said before, if you want to see something like of something with you know the Donald Trump thing or some kind of super. Oh, yeah. If you want to see all the bad choices, the good yeah, choices. Let us know down below. Let us know. Yeah. Hit us up. We'll try to work it out. I've been Alex. Greg. A lot of this stuff was gross. We don't, you know, agree necessarily about it or anything. And a lot of the actions also in the game are yeah, really questionable. Yeah. So just a heads so. up. We don't, you know. Hit us up down below if you think we're pigs, but I think we were very respectful. Yeah. Uh, we'll talk to you guys soon. Remember, be a nerd, not a dick. Later, guys.